All right, the next tab that we're going to go over, and I'm going to start every video from the invoice tab, and I'm going to jump right to the transmittal tracker. So this tab here, all this information, there's a formula in here grabbing it from your contact log. So your contact log is where you're actually going to input your market center's information, but on the tracker tab, that information will automatically pull over. It will count how many market centers you have to transmit, how many have, and how many are outstanding. And that how many have and have not is based on right here, this column here called transmitted. There's a drop down menu now. So you'll just go to the drop down menu, have they transmitted and have they or have they not. And you'll see if I put a no or if I delete the information in there and have a blank, it turns purple basically alerting me that they have not transmitted. So I can quickly visually see as I scroll through my market centers who have not transmitted. Um, so if I go here and I say, yep, they have, the purple will go away. I have my FTP, FTP site ch um, check-ins right here. I can put that information in. And then um, I also have a slot here that is not locked down. Everything else, if I double click on it, it says it's password protected. But if I go to this cell here, I can actually input a mobile cell phone. So if you have a mobile number for them, you can input that information here. And quickly, in red, all my outstanding market centers, it says I have six, and those are those six right here. And then as I add a yes, that number goes down and no, yes, and it just says purple until they, I actually mark them down as yes. And that's how the new um, transmittal tracker tab will work. So if you guys have any questions on that, check out the other training videos or email your guardian angel.